In this video, we'll be covering Airbnb's scheduled messaging feature and how it can save you a whole lot of time. Hey, what's up? I'm Mark Terry Bellini, and I'm all about achieving financial independence through real estate investing and online business. So if you're new to the channel and you're looking to achieve financial freedom for yourself, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button down below. It really does help me out, and I'll keep cranking out these videos. So Airbnb's scheduled messaging feature is a game changer, and prior to this feature, you had to message your guests about everything. Your confirmation, the welcome message, the check-in, the check-out. And if you're managing multiple properties, it becomes you know, very difficult and overwhelming because there's so many messages to send out. You're gonna forget and you know, it's, it's not gonna be good for your reviews and things like that. So this feature takes a lot of that off your hands and does it for you. So I'll show you how it works here. So here I am on the Airbnb you know, host page here and then you just go over to inbox, click on that and then click on the little hamburger menu and this will open and go down to scheduled messages. And if you have nothing here, you can just add a new message. Uh, but there's three options. You can do a booking email, check in, and check out. So I have one of each here, and I'll click in so you can check it out. Now some of this stuff is gonna be blurred out just for privacy, um, but I'll show you what I got here. So what's cool is, like I said, you can have three options here, booking, check in, and check out, and you can send them at a specific time, whenever you want. So for example, here I have a booking message immediately after. So as soon as someone books, they're gonna get a message immediately. And the message is basically saying, hello, and this code here is a short code, and I have it being pulled in as their first name here. And there's a whole list of short codes here. So you can go through and, you know, these are all automated. So whatever you wanna put in your message, you know, it kind of pulls information and inserts it. So like number of beds and, last name, you know, all kinds of stuff in here. So I just have first name, I decided to put a confirmation code and check in date and check in time. Uh, just to give them, you know, just to kind of confirm like, hey, you know, here's your confirmation of booking, you know, you're gonna be checking in on this day, this time, and um, so they know, you know, everything's squared away. I also give a little bit more information about the Airbnb suite itself just so they kind of have an idea of what to expect. And I say also like, I'm gonna give you more information as it gets closer to booking. So that's that one. And then check-in, I send this one day before at 5 p.m. And like I said, you can change this to any time and any number of days uh, before. And then what here I have, um, basically check-in, date and time. I have the address location, where to park, which is important, especially if you're, if you're living in the house and you have like a separate room or something, you wanna tell them to park somewhere specific so they know where to park. Um, how do, you know, what the, what the place looks like, you know, give a description of the house or, you know, whatever it is, give a description of it. Uh, where to go, like if you walk up to the front door, do you walk through a gate, like, what do, you, what do you do? So give them very, very clear instructions on exactly what to do so they can find it easily. And then I have a uh, section here on actually accessing get to get into the suite. And that's gonna be like, you know, an access code or, you know, a key or something like that to actually get in to the place. And so I have that. Um, also, I have Wi-Fi, so I give them the Wi-Fi password, you know, anything extra. So I have like a section on the heating and cooling of the house. And I also include the checkout date and time, so just a reminder. And telling them that I'm available for any questions or concerns they may have. Um, and then also here I have a section here, just notes. And I tell them that I'm just you know, working on the house a little bit as far as remodeling and stuff. So there's some bars and some windows and stuff from the previous owners that are going to be removed. But um, just being completely transparent is what is important here. So tell them like everything they need to know and also any rules that you want to set in place too. So here I have a, a note on to be careful with the white towels. And I say, hey, if you're going to destroy the towels and stain them, I'm going to charge you for them. So like any like rules like that, be sure to be very specific in your ad and also in your messaging so people um, know it's there, they understand, and also you can point back to it and say like, hey, you know, I, I, 
you destroyed the towels and I said in my message to you before, please handle them with care. There's other towels. If, if you want to stain those, that's fine. Um, just, yeah, so make sure you're, you're covered there. So put everything in, in your messaging. Um, so that is the check-in message. And then also here I have a check-out message. And this is sent, let's see, day of checkout at 8 a.m., just as a reminder. So again, the first name, checkout time. And also it's, it's very important to leave checkout instructions. You want to tell them exactly what to do because people, if you don't tell them what you expect, you know, you, you don't know what to expect yourself. So the lights will be left on, the door will be unlocked, um, you know, they'll have trash everywhere, the towels will be all over the room. You, know, you just have no idea what to expect. So if you tell them, it's like, hey, please turn off all the lights, close the door, lock it, put the dirty towels on the floor in the bathroom, you know, be very specific with what you want. Um, so that way you know kind of like how to judge them as far as uh, review when they check out, if they follow instructions and, and stuff like that. So it's, it's a very important thing to do. Um, so that's that. And then uh, I also say, you know, it was great, you know, having you as a guest and I wish you on, well on your way and safe travels. So this feature makes it just a whole lot easier. I don't have to send any of these messages. This is completely done for me, completely automated. So as soon as someone books, they get a message immediately. As soon as it's about time to check in, they get a message. When it's time to check out, they get a message. And I don't really have to do anything. The only time I have to do anything at all when they're here is if they send me a message and it's something specific, like they need you know, more toiletries or there's an issue or a concern or something or a question in general then I'll go in and type a message. But otherwise it's completely hands off and it makes it way easier. <laughs> so if you have not used this feature, I highly recommend it. It's gonna save you a ton of time and it's a great way to scale. If you buy more, more properties, this is, you have to do this. This is the only way to go. So if you like this content, be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.